Tyler here with GP Knives and we're back again for the week 9 weekly update. We're going to start out this week with the new Spyderco Endura Warncliffe. We're all sold out of the plain edge but we do have more on the way. Still do have some of the full spider edge serrated. See this has the same construction as the standard Endura 4 with bidirectional FRN, mid back back lock, full height flat grind, and VG10 blade steel. Got the Warncliffe style blade profile with a small section of plain edge there at the tip and then full spider edge on this one. Spider hole for opening and four position pocket clip. So great option if you love the utilitarian Warncliffe blade like I do and you want that in a larger platform than the Delica. This is going to be a great working knife for those of you who like a longer blade. Next up, we have a new variation of the Kershaw launch, and this is the model 7900 TLSW, and that is for stone wash blade and the teal anodized handle. Otherwise, this is going to be identical to the other 7900 models. You've got CPM 154 blade steel, hard anodized aircraft grade aluminum for the handles, and a reversible pocket clip, snappy button lock operation, and a great slim EDC automatic. Next up, we have the new Zero Tolerance 0393, and this is the low carbon fiber version. So, this is replacing the original variation. You've got a full working finish on the Harpoon Sponto blade, working finish on the titanium frame, glow in the dark carbon fiber on both front and back, and then a reversible tip up only pocket clip with filler tab insert, just like a hinder. And then the blade is CPM 20 CV. So excellent edge retention and corrosion resistance on this. Snappy deployment on the KVT bearing pivot. And then you're going to have a good amount of durability thanks to the thick spine and the mid height grind on that. And then we've got a couple of autos from ProTech. We've got the Italian stiletto style Don. And as with all Protex, these are 100% made in the USA of USA materials. We've got concentric ring 3D milling on the handle on this one. And that is front and back. Hard anodized aircraft grade aluminum for the handles. Black DLC coated 154 CM for the blade. And a right hand tip up only deep carry pocket clip and of course the ultra snappy coil spring automatic mechanism there and then we have the godson here same construction and materials we've got a copper rose coating on the blade and on the hardware nice coffin shaped handle on this a little more of a modern design still with that italian stiletto feel and of course, very snappy automatic deployment. And this one has a standard right hand tip up only pocket clip. And last but not least, the Spider Coefficient is now available in an all black version. So we have this in plain edge and partially serrated, black coated blade and hardware, stainless steel liner lock, 8CR 13 MOV blade. You can see it's got a nice smooth operation, very ergonomic and comfortable in the hand. Great balance thanks to the partial backspacer and reversible tip up only pocket clip on there. Great option for a budget friendly, hard use holding knife. And a quick update if you haven't been to our site recently, we are now carrying the full line of Leatherman. We've got a few of the options here. We've got the Sidekick the Skeletool RX and the Raptor holding EMT shears. These are just a few options of what we have from the Leatherman line, and you can see the full line on our site now. We also have in the house 
a couple of the Tai 2 and CWF Customs flashlight collaborations. These are called Pele's, and these are both in solid copper, so they're CNC machined from copper for the bodies. Got a paisley pattern on the center body of this one. This has got the Dragon Driver V3 user interface. And I'll just run through really quickly. So that is just the mode one standard. And this one has a red second LED, as you saw. And then the primary LED on this one, I believe, is, let's see here, it is 4000K. These are I. CRI 219C LEDs for the primaries. And then this one has a secondary LED that is amber, as you can see. And then a 5000K for the primaries. And this has the Hawaiian pattern milling on the center body. A little bit different, both very detailed. These have got a nice heft to them. They come with an 18350 rechargeable battery that powers them and a nice pocket clip. And both come in a micro pelican case for storage. Again, this is Tyler with GP Knives for your Week 9 2019 weekly update. Thanks for watching and stay sharp. If you like what you've seen today and you'd like to see more, like the video below. Subscribe to our YouTube channel feed and follow us on social media for updates on all new products.